Today we are going to learn about space and the solar system. What is the solar system? The solar system is made up of all the planets that orbit our sun. In addition to planets, the solar system also has moons, comets, asteroids, minor planets, dust and gas. Everything in the solar system orbits or revolves around the sun. The sun contains around 98% of all the material in the solar system. There are eight planets in the solar system. Starting with Mercury, which is closest to the sun. The planets are Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune. If you can't remember the correct order, try this sentence or make up one of your own. My very easy method just speeds up naming. Pluto and the dwarf planets. Scientists have discovered other objects orbiting the sun. These include comics, asteroids and dwarf planets. Like Pluto and Eris. Pluto used to be the ninth planet in our solar system. But in 2006, scientists renamed it as a dwarf planet. So now we have 8 planets in the solar system. The Sun. The Sun it is a star, it is not a planet. Our sun is just like the stars we see in the night sky. The sun is also the only star we see during the daytime. The sun is so big that you could fit more than one million Earths inside of it. It measures more than a million kilometers across. All eight of our planets orbit the sun. Depending on distance, some planets circle the sun faster than others. Let's talk about each planet and their properties. Mercury. Mercury is the planet closest to our sun. Mercury is the smallest planet. Mercury is a small rocky planet, much like our moon. It is covered with craters and has changed very little when it was formed. Scientists think that there may be volcanic activity on Mercury. Unlike m many of our planets, Mercury has no moons. Venus. Venus is the second planet from the Sun, sixth largest of all the planets. 
Venus is a small, rocky planet, blanketed in a thick layer of yellowish clouds. These clouds are not made of water, like the ones here on Earth. Instead, they are formed from a poison called sulfuric acid. Venus's surface is very hot, about 400 degrees Celsius. Venus has no moons. Earth. Earth is the third planet from the sun and the fifth largest planet. Earth is a small rocky planet which supports a lot of life. As far as we know, Earth is unique from all other planets. 71% of the Earth's surface is covered it with water. Earth is orbited by one moon. Mars. Mars is a small rocky planet which is cold and lifeless. Mars is the fourth planet from the sun. Though there is no water on Mars, Nori, it is thought that large lakes or even oceans may have once been on this planet. Mars has two tiny moons which orbit very close to the surface. Their names are Phobos and Deimos. Jupiter. Jupiter is a giant gas planet, which is made up of about 90% hydrogen and 10% helium. Jupiter is the fifth planet from the sun and the largest planet. The vivid colors seen in Jupiter's clouds are probably the result of chemical reactions. Jupiter's most outstanding and interesting feature is called the Great Red Spot. Jupiter has 16 known moons. Saturn. Saturn is the sixth planet from the sun. Saturn is a giant gas planet, which is made up of about 75% hydrogen and 25% helium. It is most famous for its thousands of beautiful rings. Saturn's rings are made up of mostly water and ice, but they may also include rocky particles with icy coatings. Saturn has 18 no moons, more than any other planet. Uranus. Uranus is a seventh planet from the sun. Uranus is a giant gas planet which is made up of mostly rock and ice. Uranus's blue colour is the result of a gas called methane. Uranus has 15 moons. Nap.
Neptune. Neptune is the eighth planet from the sun. Neptune is a giant gas planet made up of ices and rock. Neptune's winds are the fastest in the solar system, reaching 2,000 kilometers per hour. Neptune has eight known moons, seven small ones and a large moon called Triton. The moon. The moon is the Earth's only natural satellite. It is the second brightest object in the sky after the sun. The moon was first visited by the Soviet spacecraft Luna 2 in 1959. The gravitational forces between the Earth and the Moon causes some interesting effects. The most obvious is our ocean tides. The Moon has no atmosphere. What are the comets and asteroids? Comets are balls of ice and dust that orbit the sun. Asteroids are made up of metals and rocky material. What are galaxies? A galaxy can contain many millions of stars held together by the force of gravity. Our sun is in a spiral galaxy called the Milky Way. The sun is about halfway from the center of the galaxy. The universe contains at least one billion galaxies. I hope you enjoyed learning about space and the solar system. Don't forget to subscribe and leave us some feedback. And don't forget to visit us at www.learningmo.com.